Hey, what's up everybody? Um, in this video, we're gonna take a step back, um, get back to some basics here in live loops. Um, we're gonna record a song that has a simple structure, A, B, A, B structure. All right, we're just gonna use the Apple loops, so we're not gonna worry about trying to make our own loops right now. All right, so I'm gonna hit this plus button and go into loops. All right, I'm gonna click on instruments. Easiest way to start a easy foundation, I'm gonna click instruments, um, is to use your piano synth um, instruments. Um, those have some um, basic loops that tie into loops in the other instruments. So I'm gonna go into piano, scroll down here. I'm gonna use this first um, kind of one at the top that says back to school piano. And that's gonna be the loop that I'm gonna build everything on. So I'm gonna go ahead and drag that over here to my first track. All right, and that's what I'm gonna build everything else around. Um, so next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add another track. So I'm gonna hit the plus and go back into loops. All right, I'm gonna go back into my instruments. I'm hit that X there, click instruments. This time we're gonna get a drum kit here. Um, so I'm gonna go to all drums. Um, and I'm gonna look for the drums that have the same back to school name. Um, so I'm gonna scroll down here all right, notice I have, it says back to school beat. So that's gonna be the beat. I'm just gonna drag it on over here um, so that it goes with my back to school piano. All right, so I'm gonna grab it and drag it over onto my track. All right, notice I dragged it onto the second column, all right, because again, I'm building an A, B, A, B structure. That's gonna come in on my B section. All right, so now I just need to add in more instruments into my B section. First, I'm gonna copy and paste my piano part over. That's just, that part is just gonna copy and paste over for the entire song. That's the simplest way to make an AB, AB format. All right, so I hit plus. Um, now I went into my synths. Um, we're gonna look for back to school um, in, in my other instruments. I couldn't find one there, so you can actually search. Um, so I'm gonna go back to all here where it says search Apple loops and type in back to school. And what that's gonna do is it's gonna bring up all the different tracks that are that go with that back to school beat. All right, so notice I have all these different sounds that'll go with that back to school beat. Now, all I'm gonna do is just drag them over into that second column to form my B section. So I'm gonna, uh, all right, so I drag that back to school electric piano over I'm gonna drag over this back to school sax. I think I like that first one better. All right, then I'm gonna get this back to school sub bass, drag it down. And there I have my B section built. Notice I have more um, instruments layered in and that creates the B section or the chorus section of my song. All right, so now I'm gonna speed up the video clip real quick, just show you how now I just copy and paste each section to form a song that has an A, B, A, B structure. So notice that top piano one, I just keep copying and pasting it all the way through the song. Um, and then my B section here, I just build again on the, I skip a column and then build it on the next column. All right, then I end the song with an outro by playing that piano. Now I can record it. Um, to create my song. And now to record it, I just play each column from left to right, and it's gonna build the song for me. Again, here I sped up my video clip just so you can see how I'm working my way from left to right as I record, and it builds the song, and it will have an A, B, A, B structure, the simplest song structure there is. Um, as a completed product. All right, so there I, have, I finished it from left to right, recorded it. Now, if I go back to my track view, there you see my song from left to right. I have my A, B, A, B structure, or verse, chorus, verse, chorus structure, which is the simplest structure there is. And again, you see it, how it looks in live loops from left to right. And there you have a simple song, an A, B, A, B song.